What's good, Shadow Realm? It's your boy Reclaim Your Throne coming at you with another crazy video. But first, my goal is to get to 5,000 subscribers by the end of the month. So make sure you go ahead and like, comment, share, subscribe. And you already know, Reclaim Your Throne. Right here, right here, right now, right now. It's the right time, right time, right time. It's the right time, right now, right now, right now, right now, right now. Right now. Tell the whole pie down, pie down, pie down. So guys, we got to get into it, man. We are going to be talking about modern dating again. We're going to be talking about the current state of modern women. And we're going to be debunking if there are actually true eligible women who are wifey material in the dating market. Because there is a lot of rhetoric going on saying that, oh, well, there's plenty of women out here and the men suck and all this kind of stuff. But I'm going to show you examples of women who aren't marriageable. Hey, hey, don't be mad at my shorty, dog. I'm not mad Cheater at your respect. Shorty, hey. Cheater respect. Go ahead. Turn on I'm my not, boy with the ugly not, ass I'm Giants not, fucking hey, shirt hey, on. Hey, hey. <laughs> so, um, I definitely want to play this video before we get any deeper. Off rip, shorty is straight slinging insults, okay? She's flaming, bro. And a lot of women are quick at the mouth and, 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 and you know, they are very insulting to men in public especially when they get that alcohol in them so let's keep watching and see how she handles this situation hey <laughs> don't be mad at my shorty dog i'm not mad at your respect shorty, hey. respect go ahead Turn on I'm my not, boy with the I'm ugly not, ass I'm giants not, fucking hey, shirt hey, on hey, 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 you put it in the washer too hey, much huh want? and if she go fucking burn me i'm a fucking quarterback they don't even have a go fucking birds, baby. Fuck the birds. Fuck the go bird. fucking Look, birds. Let me get the mic. Let me get the mic. Look, I'm gonna tell you something. No, 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 no. And this girl, go fucking birds. Hello, how are she you? She a bird too? She got a Cali. GK Rock and Mio, they're pretty. Fuck you, wrong bitch. <laughs> I just wanna. I mean, she's very masculine. <laughs> Talking all types of greasy. She's got the white claw in her hand. You know, she probably should put that in the trash before she get, arrest, get arrested for public intoxication. But we all know that these women don't really face consequences out here. So uh, this is just kind of how things go. You know, they can walk around with an open uh, open cup and it doesn't matter. But when the men do it, it's an it's an issue. You know what I'm saying? What's the craziest thing they did on camera? Craziest thing I've done on camera. I, I be wilding out a lot of times, you know. And you could tell she's a deadhead. She probably pops Zans or, you know, goes on acid trips. You know, doing all types of experimental drugs. I mean, she looks pretty decent, though. She's in shape. But <laughs> you could just tell by the way she's slurring her words, man. Definite party chick. Definite, like, one night slam type thing. Not wifey material. Tampa. Giants, what's, what's the thing you did on camera? Yo, go get your Giants fans away from me before I get the fuck out of here. Before I get his ass, go fucking birds. Oh, yeah. Third place every year must be fun, huh? Yeah. I remember when I was fucking 12 years old. Shit's retarded. Anyway. So y'all seen that example plain in your face. Now I'm going to show you an even more bleak example of the dating market today. This is a female nurse who is talking about the caption reads when i had a pregnancy scare but my fist saved me from from spending six hundred dollars i mean this is i guess she thinks this is a joke but this isn't a joke at all watch the video it's a parade inside my city yeah. it's a parade inside my so she's acting like she uh, punched herself. Here we go, so she's punching herself in the stomach, making it seem like she's giving herself a self-inflicted, uh, you know, self-deletion of her um, infant or clump of cells. But I mean, this is very disturbing that she's making some type of joke or game out of this. When actual women suffer uh, PTSD, from deleting their child, which I've done a video on before. Um, it's, it, 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 as a nurse, you should not be um, joking about this, especially in this manner. 
in uniform at your hospital this is why y'all be getting fired she probably is on of as well or once she gets fired she's gonna get fired soon because this is inappropriate this is inappropriate for the workplace nobody wants you working at their hospital when you're joking about deleting your baby by punching yourself in the stomach because at the end of the day you're gonna have to piss that baby out and it's coming out and you're gonna see some things that you're gonna regret point blank all right uh so not wifey material multiple examples of not wifey material guys i mean modern dating is it's ob all right guys so for my final example of not wifey material we have a woman who <laughs> essentially is getting impregnated by a stranger she is looking for someone to have a kid with she's about to trap this man this man is wilding donating his you know his essence but he doesn't understand that he can be trapped by this and this is vice obviously vice the hack job network that's producing this bs so let's listen up i'm going to be having with a stranger my name is kyle gordy i'm 29 years old and i donate to uh, singles or couples in need i met kyle online while i was looking in a donation group we got to know each other we talked about the different methods of intention and he suggested natural intention, and i kind of agree because it has the most higher success rate well this should be so natural <laughs> natural conception he's going to smash this a lot of the women who are going to the sperm banks and whatnot some of them are, are are doing this option so a lot of them want to convince you that oh i'm just getting i'm just getting sperm donated and i'm a turkey baster it no a lot of them are getting it through natural conception because it's the most effective way and they're just smashing some random man that they don't know and becoming a single mother should be fun mm -hmm. it should be good you know good situation too good but a lot of men don't know a lot of men don't know to ask for that nice good i was nervous not gonna lie but it was it was a good experience boom it was nice to meet you kyle so he clapped and he busts all inside her later alligator <laughs> okay in a while later alligator and she, I, I, why did she i mean <laughs> this is the dr umar question but did she chose this this white guy to have a kid with obviously it looks like she wanted a mixed kid or did she want a kid in general or was she trying to kind of throw off her genetics because she's not the best looking i mean he's not the best looking either but i guess the mixture and the races will create a whole different looking being i mean all in all this is just horrible it, it's like worst case scenario for a lot of these post-wall women and this is going to be the result and what this guy doesn't know is that he can still be held liable for child support so uh he better hope that he got his paperwork in order and that a judge is going to honor that because he pretty much just busts all inside her and is just leaving it up to chance. Oh, crocodile? In a while, crocodile. See you tomorrow. Yes, that's how you do it. <laughs> See you tomorrow. So I guess he he's sliding back. He's sliding back for seconds to make sure she actually got pregnant. <laughs> Look, man, these women are desperate, bro. That's that's a sign of desperation. But anyways, you already know what it is, man. It's your boy Reclaim Your Throne. Make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe. Send your relationship requests to the email down below with a screenshot of your cash app so I know you're paying your tithes, man. Y'all need to be on your mark for team with the BS. You already know. Reclaim your throne. Want to become an elite level athlete? Well, look no further. The Reclaim Your Throne Elite D1 training course is all you need to take your performance from subpar to the creme de la creme of athletes all around the world. The purpose of this course is to give you a comprehensive weight training, speed, flexibility, recovery, and endurance program that is meant to prepare young athletes for collegiate and professional sports. This course is packed with over two hours of creative, action-packed lifts narrated and coached by yours truly to assure increased strength, speed, flexibility, recovery, and endurance. Hey, I get it. 
Training alone can be tough and can even make you feel misguided or somewhat unmotivated. But with this course, I walk you step by step through each and every lift to make sure you're using the proper form to prevent injuries and that you're hitting the correct muscle groups to render maximum results. So what are you waiting for? It's now or never. So go ahead and get the training course today so you too can reclaim your throne.